PeakSports.com presents the Confident Athlete Video Show starring Dr. Patrick Cohn. Dr. Cohn is a leading sports psychology expert. He teaches junior to professional athletes proven mental toughness strategies for achieving peak performance in sports. Hi, Dr. Cohn here with the Confident Athlete Video Show number three. In the last show, I talked about what is self-confidence, how do you get it, and how is it destroyed. In today's show, I'd like to talk about the number one saboteur of confidence, and that is having high or strict expectations. Let me take a second and talk a little bit about expectations and my philosophy about expectations. Expectations are not confidence. From my perspective, expectations are more judgments or demands that you place upon your performance that really have nothing to do with the execution of a motor skill. And remember, confidence focuses on execution of a motor skill or your belief in your ability to execute. Expectation is more about results and worrying about the results that you get, such as the score for 18 holes or getting points for your hockey team, for example, or expectations of trying to be perfect on the ice and not make any mistakes as an ice skater. Those are what I call strict demands or expectations. Well, why are those a problem? Well, number one, when you don't reach your own expectations, if you set unrealistic, almost irrational expectations for your performance, such as, I have to throw a no-hitter today, or I have to be perfect on the golf course, or I can't make any mistakes in my program on the ice, well, all of those examples of expectations really limit your ability and they limit your confidence. Why? Because they're so demanding, they're so high, that it's very, very difficult to reach your own expectations. And then when you don't reach your own expectations, it becomes a problem because you think you're failing. Most of the students that come to work with me have unbelievably high expectations and low confidence. And I call that the recipe for disaster. Well, why is that a recipe for disaster? Because if you have high demands and low confidence, you're not gonna be able to perform your absolute best. What we really want is absolutely no expectations. We'll replace the expectations with goals that help you focus on execution, and we want high confidence. This is what I call my number one formula for success. Perform with no expectations, high confidence, and then set manageable goals for yourself. If you want more information about how to boost your confidence, visit the Confident Athlete Series at www.peaksports.com. That's all for today, and I'll see you in the next show. Thank you for tuning in to the Confident Athletes video show. Please visit Peak Performance Sports on the web at www.peaksports.com and download a free sports psychology ebook.